Hello everyone, welcome back to Empyreon Galactic Survival Alpha 12 Experimental Phase 4. In today's episode what we're going to do is we're going to go try to take on the drone base on the moon here. I'm pretty confident that we can get the job done. Uh, but uh, we need to wait for our shields to come up. Let's reload. The drone base is in a peculiar spot and I'm thinking I can take the... Uh, shields down so uh, let's ping and I'll show you what I mean um, there's the drone base right there um, and a lot of drones we're gonna sneak up to it and just cap the drones that we can like the one that's right there whoops Take out all these drones that are here. Okay, so we're in a safe spot right now. Let's see if we can't loot some of those drones. And uh, assess the drone base here. What do we got? Uh, some bullets. Uh, nothing to write home about. Flux coils, please? No. I did build the uh, little miner. Uh, I haven't brought it into the world just yet because... Uh, I want to clear the moon first. Okay, let's... I think this valley right here will give me... Uh, oh, please. Thank you. Um, we have... Looks like one more drone to take out. Um, I don't see any more drones. That rocket turret right there is going to be our problem. Whoops. A little bit too much roll there, Storm. There you go. Yeah. It's only one rocket turret. I don't think it's going to do too much damage to us. Let's see if I duck down just a little bit more. I'm not hitting the uh, turret anymore. We'll just have to be very mindful about our shields and watch them like the hawk. Our range is 400 meters. Okay, we're down to 50% shields. Come on, shields, come up. Okay. Eighty-three percent, eighty-two percent. We're gonna need all the rockets to take out the turrets. Oh, those turrets almost can see me. If we can get it down to 50%, we'll be doing good. We're going to have to duck and cover here in a second. Yeah, duck and cover. 61%. This is a very slow process of uh, taking out the uh, old drone base here. I mean, I could use rockets, but they just end up hitting the dirt. Get it down to 40% and then we'll duck in. We might have to duck in sooner, but we'll see. Come on, four gats. Take it. Reload in here. We'll make use of that time. Our goal is to take that top turret out because it's the rocket turret that's going to do the most damage to my ship. We'll get down to 28% and then we'll duck in. Maybe 27%. Okay, 27%. Let's uh, get our shields back. I did load up on Pentaxid. No shields for you.
Come on. Sixteen percent. Fifteen, fourteen. We're doing good on our shields. We're about to run out of ammunition. So while it's reloading, we'll uh, get our shields back up. Eleven percent on there. Okay, we don't want them to keep regenerating. We want them to not de regenerate. Take out that rocket turret on top there. Five percent. Three percent. We should be doing damage to the turret right about now. And that's the first one we're going to take out with some gats. Once it falls, then we'll know where we're ready to go into attack mode. Come on. Take that turret down. Am I even hitting that turret? Yeah, okay. Let's recharge our shields. Um, rockets are already loaded. Gas already loaded. So what we're going to do is we're just going to peek over the mountain here. And uh, there's a turret right there. Nailed it. Where else is there turrets? All uh, right. There. Huh. Did I take out the core? No. They, they were lagging behind there for a second. Box three, two, one, blast off! Die, turret. What's up, troop transport? Always looking all funny up there in the uh, platform. I love this drone base. It doesn't have very much loot in it, but, uh... Okay. We can get out of that mode and back into, uh... Oh, we have a turret left. Right... There. Oh, we have another turret still, right? There. Okay. Let's land and grab this troop transport loot. Uh, what? Oh, there's a turret right there. Okay. Let's land real quick. I think we're safe here. Ouch. Let's uh, go grab the uh, loot from the troop transport. It's usually pretty good. Look at that. Pulse rifle, some air. Um, did we bring air with us? No, we didn't. Yeah, well, we got a little bit of air. Okay, this one, this drone base is kind of uh, a weird one. You have to make an opening because uh, the opening is uh, on top. Like up top there, um, you basically see that door right there. You go in that way, but I never do that. Um, what you want to do is you want to go kind of catty corner here and then bust a hole right straight through here where this double pane glass is. Um, and that's usually where I go in. We're going to go grab the capital vessel because I want to be protected by uh, drones and whatnot, and it's got shields on it. So we're going to go in that and it'll give me a health spawn reason. Uh, I helped, uh, you know, I can respawn there and I can also go back and heal if I need to. If I'm really desperate and and whatnot. Level off, please. Thank you. And go in. Turn that way a little bit. Don't dock. There you go, now dock. Turn the Y off. I don't know why I keep getting hurt by that ship. That's okay. Take a shower, heal up, go up to the old captain's chair up here, uh, and uh, turn on the thrusters. Don't think there's any bad guys going to kill me anymore. So we're going to go over here and park by the uh, the drone base and to give me, uh, there's some iron right there I can probably mine out in between videos. Right now I'm doing a video, uh, um, a few videos today. So, uh, if you've left any comments, I haven't seen them yet. Okay. So, we got 15 mil rounds. We don't have a shotgun anymore because I sold it. 
We have an assault rifle. We have a plasma cannon. You know, can we make any plasma cannon cells? Let's look real quick. Oh, troop transport came back. Uh, weapons. Laser rifle. Plasma cannon. Okay, so all the weapons are unlocked. Plasma cannon. Yeah, I don't have any of that. Okay, whatever. Let's go uh, say hello to the drone base and see what it has to offer us. I know there's any troops around here real quick before I go down in the old doorway. Mm -hmm. I hear ticky tocks. Down the elevator we go into the depths. Shotguns are sniper rifles, Xerox, right off the get go, huh? Really, uh, really want to kill me, huh? Let's just go miscellaneous stuff, EVA boost. I almost missed that turret. Yeah, these are sniper Xerox. Those would not have been a good thing to uh, come up against. Stupid troop transport reminds me of a drone. Reload. Are oh, you a little turd? Oh, I'm remembering this drone base now. There's some Xerox through that door right there, but let's take care of the... Your long range... Your shotgun doesn't go that long. That's right. Your shotgun does... Your shotguns don't go that long. So as long as I'm way away from you, buddy, you cannot shoot me and kill me. But there should be a turret somewhere down here somewhere. I thought there was a turret in this doorway. That's what you call close encounters. Mm. Energy bar. Thank you, buddy. Before I uh, commit to this room here. Oh, yeah, this is the one that's got the T2 generators in it. Oh, what's that? Heavy armor. Nice. Okay. Okay, get ready for the fight of my life here. I hate these catwalks. Um, there's usually uh, creatures down there. I preferably don't want to jump down there. I want to know where they are. Yeah, radiation from the, dr the generator. I don't see any over there. Yeah, we're getting out of this area as quickly as possible. <sighs> Hide behind the box. Box is your friend. I always, I always love this drone base. Slowly work our way towards the uh, little bit of uh, magnesium. I could have gone worse. Where are you, stupid turret? There you are, right? I got one of them. Gotcha. Ticky Duck Robots. I got all these loot, right? No, I missed that one. Okay. Don't core this place. You'll blow up the uh, T2 generators, by the way. 
and I want the T2 generator loot. I want to take it with me. Reload my uh, sniper rifle real quick. Yeah, look at that. Two T2 generators. Mmm, yummy. What did that sensor just do? I don't know. Oh, this area. Are you coming up the stairs, bro? Or did I cap you? Where's that turret at? Thought there was a turret hitting me, not just a ticky dock robot. There's a spawn pad right there. I hear another ticky dock robot. I just don't know where he is. It's probably around this corner here. We're gonna need to do some healing here in a second. Anything back here worth mentioning or getting? Do the uh, fly so I can get across this floor a little bit quicker. Okay. Okay, time for a health pack. It's my first one of the uh, venture here. Oh, I was just making sure there's no turf. What's up, turret? Is there more at the other end? No, just this end. Take out this spawn pad here. Make sure these uh, ticky dark robots don't spawn back. Okay, final boss room. Coming up. I'm not opening that switch, by the way. Oh yeah, there's a, uh, there's a purple container somewhere around here. Access this. Don't hit the switch. I'm not hitting the switch. There used to be, I think it was behind this one. Uh, one of these is, uh, there's a loot container. I think. Don't quote me on it. Or is it behind these? I think it's behind these. I can't believe I just did that right. I hurt myself. We'll figure it out here in a second. A hey, robot, where are you? Man, you got some hit points. Ooh, two power coils. Pretty much the drone base is done. Uh -huh. and, you know, here's the core. And we have something for the core. Right here. Oh, there's a window there. Well, that's okay. We can we can just slide it up in there like that. What kind of loot are you giving me? Oh, gold. Oh, some zaz. Okay. Congratulations. Yeah, whatever. I didn't grab that. Uh, F4. No, we want the spa. Um, miscellaneous stuff. 
miscellaneous stuff isn't full. Well, let's just shove all this miscellaneous stuff over. Heat up on the, uh... Can I pick that up now? No, I can't. Okay. Link up. No, it's too heavy. It can't go in that box then. Um, it's just going in that box. And now I can't see it because the other box is in the way. I'll have to give it a second. Is this drone base made out of combat steel? It is. Oh yeah, we're gonna we're gonna be uh, we're gonna be uh, dismantling this for my CV. Now, if I'm remembering correctly, this opens a secret doorway which gives you three loot containers. Um. Oh, there we go. Large uh, optometric matrices and a uh, a uh, gun. I don't think there's anything that way now. And that was just the hidden room back that way. We can just zap some of these uh, consoles away. Get a whole bunch of computers and whatnot. Don't think there's anything else over this way. No. Okay, that is the drone base done. Let's uh, go assess the rest of the uh, moon real quick. While I'm thinking about it. Um, I want to link up to the container controller. Because I want these generators that are here. Um, what's... Actually, I don't... Uh, that's a little bit of satium. We need to keep all the safety and blocks intact. Ah, uh, here we go. O2. Look at that. A bunch of O2. Yeah, we're going to take this apart. Um, but I don't need the uh, T2 generators. Um, so, what we can do is just go bloop. And get all the flex coils and whatnot that you get from them. Did I take the fuel out? No, I still have not taken the fuel out. Okay. Is this the bottom floor? No. This is the bottom floor, right? Okay. So what we're going to do now that the generators are gone, we're going to pop a core down. There you go. Okay. Let's get out of here. I can do this off camera, uh, taking this drone base apart. I don't, I'm going to go show you with the last loot containers. And then uh, we're going to go uh, see what the rest of the moon's got to offer. Let's do the jumpy jump thing here. And get over here and get out of here. I'm getting pretty good with the jetpack. Could have sworn there was a loot container behind this wall. No. Okay. Just a wall. This drone base is pretty simple. Take the door. I don't need the deco. Two more loot containers. Uh, yeah, we'll just take those as parts. Oh, do I want to take that hole? I think I want to take that hole. I don't know where the shield generators went off to. Um, yeah, just take it all into the, uh, inventory. Mm, some more guns, some more fuel. Where is the generator at? Or the, uh, P devices? Just auto group and be easier. Um, lights, fuel tank, flares, equipment. Is it under equipment? Polarized hole shield. Show on HUD. It's up top somewhere. So let's go up. It says it's on this level somewhere. 
What's up, troop transport? There you are, beautiful. Oh no, it's glitched out. Come on. There it is. There it is. I got gotcha. you. Grab some fuel here. Whoops. I didn't mean to do that. I don't want to fall way down here. Just making my way out. Okay. That's the drone base. Let's go, uh, since the drone base is taken out, let's go take the hobby ship out for another run. Um, let's get some air in us first. And, uh, I think we're good. We got 800 rounds. We got some projectile rounds. We're not really hurting for rounds. Um, F4 on link for a second. Let me pick my tomatoes real quick. Because food is a... Oh, spice is ready too. Nice. Player inventory. O2, please. Shower, just in case we got rats. Okay. Let's eat up on something. What do we got? Well, let's eat a can of food. And maybe an energy bar. Okay. So back in the hobby ship and let's go fly around a little bit more and see what else we can uncover. Ah, oh, it's too close to the door. I gotta get a bigger ship. Actually, you know what? It, the uh, matrixes and the bridges are gonna be the one thing holding me back on the uh, Vulcan ship. But if we can uh, keep raiding uh, drone bases that are pretty easy, then we should be able to basically um, bring in a, uh, a uh, the Vulcan. I'm hoping in this playthrough and I'm hoping that uh, I'll have to loot that later. I want the troop transport real quick before it despawns. Okay, are we close enough to the main ship? We are. Just put this stuff over there and that for now. Okay. What does this moon have to offer us? I'm not doing the Titan quest thing until Stable Branch. So, uh, yeah. There's a drone right here, huh? Looks like you're underground there, bud. They like the ground, whatever. These two didn't. What's she shooting at? There we go. What is this crash something rear? Does it got thrusters on it? Hmm. Whatever. I'm looking for red. Oh, there's a resource over here. Let's go see what it is. Look at the terrain pop, pop in and out. It is, the, get, the Alpha 4 is not optimized um, at all. Um, it needs some work for sure. Scanner is recharging, I know, I'll wait. We're in 300 meter range, Pentaxid. Actually, you know what? Let's mine that Pentaxid out. Do a little bit of mining here. I could use some Pentaxid, so. Oh, it's only got one little notch. Make sure we're hooked up to the container controller. Thirty-three, huh? Build the hole in just so in case I decide that I want to do a walkabout on a moon. I mean, I don't have to worry about the drone base anymore. Because we took that out. There's more to this moon than that. Let's, uh... Let's scan and see what we can find. Oh, we just entered the... Oh, we entered Xerax territory. Okay. What kind of ter Xerax territory do we got? Oh, we got the, the mainframe here. 
I totally they said they moved it to the uh, moon. That just blew the heck and back. Sorry for it being dark, everyone. I oh, missed it. There's another one over here. Crushy, crushy. You got some range, homie. You're going down. We're not doing the, the mainframe. We'll get rid of the uh, drones, but uh, I'm not doing the mainframe today, I don't think. Sorry for it being dark. I got my lights on the best I can here, everyone. Just killed the uh, 400 billion zone drones. Fortifications taken out, right? I I nuked the bottom of it. Okay. What do we got over here? Ah, uh, whoop. As I run into the ground here, there's another drone right here. Maybe you ought to see if the mainframe is buried or whatnot. There's another drone right here. I know this is part of the story arc is the only reason I, I don't want to do it right now. There's nothing to shoot at me, so we're good to go there. We pretty much neutralized the um, fortifying turrets, right? You know, I just... Drones need love, devs. Uh, I don't trust this anti-aircraft turret, so I'm just gonna blow it away. I know I probably could get back some parts or whatnot, but I don't care about the parts right now. Um, down drone, down drone, okay. So is there anything else on this moon other than the mainframe or whatnot? Yeah, there's another Xerox area over there. That's nothing though. Okay, I think that's uh, that's pretty much it, unless we want to go into the mainframe and uh, not destroy the core, or just go in and just you know do the mainframe and come back out. I already know where the core is on it now after watching a couple of videos where they moved the core to. Let's see, let's see what else is on the moon real quick. Got a silicon deposit. I really could use some more titanium. Polarized whole shield POI. Oh no, I forgot to take that marker off. <laughs> Is it still on my map? Or did they fix that yet? No, they didn't. I'm going to have that polarized whole shield on my uh, marker forever now. That's yeah, okay. We're not going to be staying on this uh, planet or this moon too long. wants us to go away in. I really don't want to do the uh, Titan quest part. We're going to bypass it. And uh, I think that's pretty much. We're going to do a little bit of mining. Uh, I need the capital vessel to do the mining though. I, uh, man, that's going to be, that's going to bug me. You know what we can do maybe? Maybe we can, uh, Maybe we can cheat the system and put the polarized whole shield back in and then remove the marker and then uh, and then try that. Maybe that'll uh, uh, fix it. Let's see. There's a troop transport on the ground here.
because I really don't want that polarized whole shield thing on my my map thing. Uh, what you doing, Storm? Stop with the W key keyboard. Lay down. Thank you. Landing gear is engaged. Weapons are received. Nice, a weapon upgrade kit. I can sell a couple more rocket launchers now. So let's see if we can put this polarized hole shield back and see if I can't uh, tick that off my uh, list. So let's go like this and um, F4. Um, I think we put it in this box, right? There we go. We got it figured out. So if you ever run across that issue, you can place the item back down and then you can remove the uh, tag. But I want this polarized hole shield from my base. Oh, we missed something here. Okay. Good. Now that little marker's not on there. Um, let's do some mining. I mean, we don't have very much time left. Um, we'll just park the uh, ship on top here. Because there's no other drones that, I got, that I've seen on the uh, map. Okay, so um, I can take this drone base apart and get the materials that I need for the uh, capital vessel. As long as we get the safety and we should be good to go. Where's the deposit at? Oh, Pentaxid is our first one, huh? Let's uh, drop down here on the Pentaxid. This is what I did on the uh, other planet. I would literally just land here, turn off the thrusters. I really don't need to. Because this is a pretty small deposit of Pentaxid. And then, uh, I don't need that. Let's, let's put this stuff over here. Um, link up to that. I really need some pentaxid, so we're gonna mine out some pentaxid, and we're probably gonna do some uh, warping in the next episode. Um, take the cores off, put the uh, detector back. There it is. Does it have ore in it? Yeah, one little piece right down there. Just in case I come back through here and I need to. Uh, walk across the moon. I don't want to fall in a big gaping hole. Perfect. One pentaxid down. How many pentaxids are left on this planet? Our moon, I should say. Pentaxid. Um, I think we mine out all the pentaxid real quick. And the titanium. I want to see if titanium meteorites fall. So let's, uh, let's go grab the pentaxid. Uh, first and then well, I want to see if uh, titanium meteorites fall because if titanium meteorites fall I'm going to spend some time moving around the, the map um, looking for basically uh, um, titanium because oh, there's another one I don't need iron I could use some more silicon but let's uh, let them do with your job against the drones real quick oh, it's pleasing hot in here today 85 in my house and I don't have the fan turned on right this second because I'm recording But it is very hot in here I'm wearing shorts and it's still blazing hot But uh, I want I need to make a couple of videos today So I was like yeah, I just gotta bear with it, you know and uh, get the job done Because that's what is required of me if I turn the fan on, you guys would be able to hear it through the mic, and I really don't want that. So, it's all good. We'll get this job done, get a little bit more mining done. Fill the hole back in. We're going to grab all the pentaxid and the titanium and see if they're, uh, if titanium meteorites fall. We'll know uh, as soon as I mine out the last one of the uh, titanium. Iron, iron, silicon. Silicon, iron. I have plenty of iron, I do. 
crashed capital vessel. Drone that just got killed. Mount Magnesium. Yeah, we want some of that too. I think there's only what? One Magnesium left on this planet? Grab it up real quick. And then there's... I'm gonna mine out the whole entire moon. It's just a matter of uh, needing certain types of... Uh, that uh, that cobalt's gonna be too long of a dig time. So we're gonna hit this Magnesium and... Uh, see if we start getting meteorites to fall. It's not gonna take me that long to dig out the uh, Magnesium. So we just keep the shit running. Usually takes me a couple seconds to mine out the uh, magnesium. Boom, boom, boom. Well, it might take me a couple minutes. Nah, it's not gonna take me that long. I'm almost halfway through the deposit, probably. They don't give you very much magnesium. They really want you to go out to other planets and literally, uh, you know, uh, you know, mine out the other planets. I'm gonna use this, uh, this like play field as a my mining zone, so I can come back here and mine whatever I want. And then I'm gonna use my home planet, basically the sector as an auto miner placement. And then I'm just gonna mine out whatever is in this sector and whatever ore I need, I'll take with me. Um, it's just a matter of how much ore can I take with me into my new home. Because I would like to build a base on a temperate world. That is, uh, is my preferred. There's a temperate moon in this sector, but I don't want to build a base on a moon. I want to build it on a planet. So I'm thinking probably in the next episode what we're going to do is we're going to do some warping. And a little bit of mining out, uh, Zascosium and Arrestrum and some more titanium. And, uh... Yeah, that's probably what we're going to do um, in the next episode. We're going to mine out some uh, titanium and whatnot. Fill the hole back in. Okay, we should be getting meteorites of uh, magnesium now. Now we just need to find the pentaxid. It says there's a resource over there by the comms array. Silicon, iron. It's really hard to see when they're all grouped up like that. I wish they, I'm, I wish there was like a scanner. Uh, if you could have a choice between the scanner, you know, uh, do like uh, three different scanners. One for ore, one for POIs, and um. And I can't think of the third one, but maybe just two, two, two detectors then. One for ore and one for buildings. Of course, you really need to know if the building's coming up in front of you. But I mean, you could usually see the building. Uh, what kind of resources are these? I'm looking for my last pentaxid and titanium. There's pentaxid and there's the titanium. Hello, my boys. There's the uh, another pentaxid. We're gonna mine this out, and then we're gonna we're gonna actually we're gonna probably call it a video here. I'm just gonna mine out the moon uh, and get all the ore goodies. And uh, in the next episode, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go warp around. So I do hope that you have enjoyed this episode. If you did, make sure you storm that like button. And if you're new here, subscribe for more daily videos. Okay, everyone, take care and bye bye.